Here's a Final Cut Pro quick tip, and um, I want to analyze a cut. You know, that sometimes you just want to hear a cut. So I had to make a cut here, and uh, I'm just going to make sure that I zoom in on the timeline. I'm going to hit the R. That's the range selection tool, or you can go right here. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to select about, let's just say, one, sec about one second there and then about from right there. Now, usually I would just, you know, play. How does that happen, you might ask? But if I want to play and stop, I'm going to hit the, uh, what is this button? The button right under the question mark. I can't even remember the slash, the backslash. Your relationships. How does that happen, you? Your relationships. How does that your relationships how your relationships how so if I don't like that I can go back and I can go and edit this with either the trim tool or see how I can just do the T and just move that over some then I can go back to the R tool and then I can just hit backslash into your relationships how to talk into your relationships and I'm going to hit the T key again once here and then I'm going to move that over some and hit the R key. Range selection. Shortcuts are real important. So, range selection. I'm going to do this. And then I'm going to hit the backslash. How does that relationship? How does relationships? I know it's a jump cut, so I, it's, it's, I, I don't mind that right now. Into your relationships. How does that happen when you might ask? Okay, so that is a quick tip of when you are editing. Uh, the range selection tool, the backslash key to play in between our ranges. All right, take care.